Hey everybody, and welcome to Bob Appetit. We have a special What About Bob episode uh, here today. Why don't I start, huh? The simplest way to put it, I have problems. It's gonna be a short one, just kind of talking about where we've been over the last several weeks. We haven't really put out any new videos and what our plans are going forward. This year has been kind of crazy. COVID set a baseline and it's really just gone wild from there. As some of you know, having watched some of my previous videos, I've had a family member diagnosed with cancer and I also had the fortune of finding out before my grandfather was about to pass and was able to go home and see him. What was amazing about that experience is that my grandfather told me a lot of the family history that honestly I hadn't bothered to ask uh, before that point. He then asked me to do something very special to me. He asked me to cook him a dish that he would have had growing up. I'm grateful that I did. It was a wonderful experience and I brought some joy to him that I don't think the rest of the time I was there I, I saw quite the same smile. And that sparked something in me. It sparked the excitement of, of why I really liked cooking to begin with. Cooking for others, sharing the experience, but also the knowledge and the history and why all of this information is so important. It, it can really bring everyone to the dinner table. And so it really just lit a fire inside of me and I wanted to pursue that passion more. And I had some crazy opportunities to go with one of which was getting to meet Kenji and also the awesome Stella and Sunny from Stella Finds Truffles. And we went on a crazy truffle hunt. And you probably saw the video of the truffle ice cream that I made with the truffles we found on that hunt. But I also got the opportunity to cook in a restaurant. And so I've been learning and sort of understudying at, at a local restaurant and getting to hone in some skills and get a lot more understanding than I ever had before. It's like a immersion into some of the stuff I had just been reading in books. All that is to say that I have so much more that I want to share with you in the next coming weeks from the things that I've learned studying more about my family's history in Italy and just Italian cooking in general to other histories of food and the science behind them and how they work to also exposing a bit more of my nerd as you've seen in the D&D cookbook that I showcase every once in a while. But there's a ton of other nerderies that I have and whether or not I can find a recipe on some of those dishes, I can certainly make them up. Be prepared for a bunch more videos to come for the rest of this year. We're talking full length videos, shorts, tons of different things because we have not stopped studying at the dinner table. I'll catch you next time. I have a lot of books. Is that too many?